Now hold it, wait a minute now. Oh, wait a minute now, shorty, won't you wait a minute now? Hey, everybody. I'm trying to make sure I don't break my camera because it's like. <clears throat> so, I've been gone a long time. I'm sorry. Um. I've been really busy. I had finals a couple of weeks ago, so I was saying for that, bitch, I got all A's and one B. Yep, I'm smart, too. Um, what else? Oh, and then the week before last, I was with my friend at her school. And I spent the whole week there. It was fun. And then what else did I do? And I've just been chilling, guys. But I have been busy because I started summer school. I'm taking one summer class. It'll be over in a week. After this week, one more week in the sun. So, then I officially have my good summer fun. Anyways, so I got my hair done on May 6th. That video about the deep conditioner or whatever, I made that May 6th. So, this is late. I'm sorry. Um, I took pictures when I was with my friend. I took pictures then, and so I'm just going to like crop those pictures and show those to y'all. Because I didn't take any pictures of my hair as far as you know, just it by itself. So I'm going to crop out some pictures and put those up there. Um, what else? Oh, I wanted to say thank you to my subscribers, you know. I'm always surprised when I get a new one because, you know, people are sure paying attention to what I do. That's cool. Um, and I'm glad that I can help, you know. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. I make it a point to always, always, always reply to the comments and I know I don't know if that's weird or something because like if I, if I watch other people's videos they don't really reply as much as I do but I just feel like you took the time out of your day to reply on my comment I mean, I mean on my video so I can take the time now to answer your question or at least say thank you you know I don't know I say thank you like a lot like I find myself just saying thank you a lot but that's the type of person I am <coughs> so I have pictures of my hair down from when I was with my friend, but it's like me drinking water, okay, drinking water, I'm underage, okay guys, um, it's water, and I have another one, she put up one, I'm gonna try to get hers and then put that in the end, um, let me see what else, oh, let me tell you about my, my, my salon lady, tell me, my Dominican lady, that's what I call her, my Dominican lady, she's crazy, so, um, so I haven't had a trim since, like, December. I got that, like, almost two inches trimmed off. And I've been taking care of my hair, no heat, you know, no rough combing, no rough handling, just butt putting it up in a ponytail or twisting it up, whatever. So me, it's like, oh yeah, you need a trim today, girl, you need a badge, you may need two trims. So I'm thinking, okay, maybe I have split in. Okay, so I'm like, well, wait, let's wait until after you relax and then we'll see how it looks, okay? And then... Afterwards, I'm like, oh, she, she started getting ready to cut it, and I'm like, well, wait a minute, let me see it. I'm looking at it, it looks fine, like, so do I have split ends or something? She's like, no. So this raises my question, did I even need the first trim? I'm pretty sure I needed the first trim, because I hadn't had one in a while, but... Guys, make sure you ask your hairdresser why she's trimming your hair. Don't just let her trim your hair because she says you need one, because she's scissor happy, because she, like, uses scissors like her freaking crack, because she was so excited to like put the thingy on me to get ready to cut it. I was like, whoa, my hair looks fine, you know. She's like, oh yeah, yeah, your hair looks good, you know. Um, it looks really healthy. You don't have no split ends. So why are you trying to trim my hair? Like, what is wrong with you? I was so mad at her, <laughs> but she didn't trim it, and yeah, it looks fine. I don't know. I'll show y'all the pictures. I'm gonna get a trim in August though. I really, cause I need, I do need a trim, but you know, I don't need one like often. I'm not using heat on my hair or anything, doing anything to make it to the point where it needs a trim. But I mean, just to keep it looking, I don't know, even and stuff, I'm going to get a trim in August. So I was like, okay, crazy lady. But I mean, I still love her because she's good. And my hair has gotten a lot thicker since I started going to her. Because um, she does those good roller sets and I don't have to get my hair flat ironed or curled with the iron or blown out or anything. I just, this time I had to wrap it because... I think she keeps using freaking Mazzani or something, and that does not get my hair straight. And people say, oh yeah, if you flat iron it, it's so nice, but I don't flat iron, so I need something real, like a real, something straight in my hair. 
So I don't know. I'm gonna talk to her about that one. But I mean, it's supposed to be healthier and everything. But I want my hair to be straight. I'm not putting chemicals on my hair for it to not to be straight. Anyway, what else? <coughs> oh, I have a new goal for this summer though. Since I pretty much got the heat thing down, only got like three months until I'm done. My goal for this summer is I'm trying to grow out my nape. It's like, let me see, in the back, most of my hair is like right here. And then my nape is like right here. It's like on my shoulders, a little past my shoulders, a little bit. I'm like, well, maybe that has something to do with it not being so thick. So, what my mom keeps harassing me to do, she keeps harassing me to braid it at night. And I've just been moisturizing it more and like putting oil on it and stuff. But, I'm going to start braiding it. And then by the end of the summer, I'll see if it made a difference. And then I'll thank her after that. But, um, so I'm going to be moisturizing more and stuff and trying to braid it at night. I've been braiding it so far and it just feels, it feels good. It doesn't feel like dry or anything, you know. But, um, yeah. And I don't know if my hair looks good or not because I just threw it up for y'all. I just got back from a graduation party and my hair was in a French twist and I took it out and I was like, oh crap, I forgot to make a video. So, this is what I ended up with. I put it in a ponytail and I like pushed it up. I don't know. I don't know if that's cute or not, but that's what y'all are getting. Yep. Um, that's about it. Thanks guys. Bye.